All right, folks, since, uh, you know, the piston, you know, system is, you know, what's hot in the streets right now, that's what everyone's going to. And depending on the piston setup, you might be able to use a side folding stock. That's right. Not just for AKs anymore. Um, what we have here is the U.S. machine gun side folding stock adapter. Um, we're able to use this because it's on a uh, fax and a racks, you know, setup. And uh, the kind of neat thing about this, you can use it for a lot of different setups. You can use it, you know, on AK setups, AR, if they, you know, have the piston set up. Um, I've seen pictures of them on uh, Mac 10 type setups. Um, it uh, screws right into the, you know, the receiver. Um, it basically adds extra length uh, to your buffer tube system. Um, the reason why you're able to use this uh, with a faction is because it has a, uh, you know, an AK, AK style uh, operating system um, where you don't have a buffer tube in this system. Uh, you know, if you had an H and K or a Ruger or uh, even the Sig piston setups, um, those all still require a buffer tube assembly. So you're able to get away with this because this uh, screws into the back of the uh, receiver and actually, you know, obviously, you know, you know, that's solid. There's, you know, you're not going to have your uh, bolt carrier group come back and, you know, cycle into the buffer system. But now we're going to get into this. Um, there is some play with this. Any type of side folder, there's going to be a little bit of wobble. Um... Just like, you know, if you have any type of collapsible stock, there's going to be a little bit of wobble compared to a fixed stock. Um, now, this gun isn't, you know, set up for, you know, precision shooting, so there's a tad bit of wobble to it. Um, at first, you know, when I first got it, it was, you know, more stiff, but, you know, messing around with it. Uh, got a little bit loose, um, so that does kind of suck. Um, but overall, you know... Having, you know, the side folding ability, you know, if you want to, you know, store it, you know, in a smaller bag, you know, instead of having to buy, you know, bigger, you know, case, um, just to look cool, you know, you know, maybe you're a person, you know, that keeps, you know, a, uh, rifle, you know, in their truck or whatever, you know, it's easier, you know, store it on a seat or, you know, whatever storage compartment you have. Um, and just, you know, it's something different, you know, if you have the ability, you know, get a side folding stock, why not? Um, overall, you know, it's really, really cheap. I think it was, uh, $45, um, before shipping and handling, uh, guy, uh, got it out to me the same day I, uh, shipped it the same day I ordered it. Um, U.S. Machine Gun, you know, they have a, uh, actually, you know, pretty good customer service system, so... Um, that was a huge positive. Um, the wobble is a little bit annoying, but it's, you know, something that's going to happen. It's just like, you know, if you're shooting at, you know, an SBR, you're going to understand you're not really going to make, you know, accurate shots, you know, at 100 yards or 200 yards. It's a, you know, gun design, you know, for 25 yards and in. But, um, overall, um, it's a lot cheaper than the, uh, Law side folder setup, which is running like 200 bucks, you know, when it first came out. Uh, don't know if it's dropped at all, but um, if you're looking for a side folder adapter, you know, for your AK, or if you have a you know, a rack or other system like this, and you want to roll with a side folder, um, I highly recommend the US machine gun. I'd probably give it a uh, seven and a half out of ten. Um, you know, if there's any way they could, you know, figure out how to make it a little bit more sturdy, you know, I'd give it, a, you know, eight and a half. Um, but, it, you know, it's a pretty cool setup, you know, it's, you know, a doodad, you know, something, you know, that makes your rifle different. Um, but if you're in the uh, market for side folder adapters, uh, check out U.S. Machine Gun. Uh, I'll put a link to their website in the uh, info section. Thanks, and uh, comment, like, subscribe, whatever. Troll me, don't care.